Hi everyone, my name is Jared Lank. I'm a Mi'kmaq filmmaker from Southern Maine, and I'm the director of Bay of Herons, a film playing this year in the U.S. Shorts program at the 2024 Sundance Film Festival. Bay of Herons is very much a visual essay that I made about my own reflection and this contemplation I always have in the presence of nature. The film originally started about the abandoned school at the center of the island, but I quickly found myself leaning more into creating a film about my own experience going to the island in this kind of recursive approach to capturing the life there and how it made me feel not only as an indigenous person living in their traditional homelands, but as a human being experiencing the complex emotions of cultural loss and cultural resiliency. A huge component of the story I'm telling in Bay of Herons is the inclusion of a 20th century Wabanaki story about our cultural hero Gluskop and his approach to the French to try to understand them. You know, this story was being told after hundreds of years of interactions with the West at this point, and it really reflects our cultures and our people trying to understand what is happening to them in this process. You know, growing up in my family and seeing the effects of this on my family has had a profound impact on me and how I choose to live my life today. You know, I really tried to focus on the duality in the landscape of Mackworth Island, this Western establishment in this abandoned building and school in the middle of the island, contrasted with the natural world that has re-encroached upon it in a way almost forcing out or rejecting the idea of Western establishment on its foundation. Anyway, that's it about Bay Herons and my process in making the film and some of the reasoning for the creative choices I made. Hope you get a chance to check out the film at Sundance this year and I hope you have a great day.